Why, hello there. Welcome back to my daily long play stream. This is why I do a playthrough of my current game for a couple hours a day, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time from Wednesday through Sunday. At least that's normally how it goes. Sometimes life interferes, life finds a way to delay the start of a delay a stream, and that's what happened here. But life goes on. I am once again playing Sonic Frontiers on the Xbox Series X. And I fully expect that this will be my last week of streaming this game as I'm in the last world and I only have a couple more Chaos Emeralds to collect. So yeah, uh, I figure that by this, certainly by Sunday, this game will be done. In fact, I honestly don't expect to be streaming on Sunday, possibly not even on Saturday. But rather than just sitting here yapping, let's just jump in and pick up where I left off. And where I left off was here in the last island. I need three more portal keys. To I need uh yeah three I need more portal keys to collect the sixth chaos emerald. I assume the seventh one will be on whatever creature is um I have to fight. Let's see here, one two. Three. Three, four, five, six. Yeah, there's only six of these things. And yeah, now I need to go ahead and go to one of these um, portals. There's one over here, and unfortunately I need three of these gears before I can get it. So, I guess I have to go ahead and find some guardians to take out. Hopefully not like an annoyingly difficult one, because I don't want to deal with that. But yeah. In addition to that, I'd also like to see if I can do uh, these island mysteries, and also do the, uh, what do you call it, the... Uh, do the last bit of uh, story dialogue. I should point out that I don't necessarily have to fight these guardians in order to get these hog pieces because I can in fact get them from lots of different sources. Heck, I even even get them out of the ground just by doing this. Although that is uh, pretty unlikely yet to happen. That was a memory that I made a bunch of do the story missions. But, uh, the situation is I would like to get some more coins. Ooh, another attack upgrade. I should probably cash that in before I take on any of these guardians. I need to get some more coins to get up to full health. And it's entirely possible that in the process of doing this, I will get a, um, one of these cards. It has happened. It has happened exactly like that. A little more often than not, I get like this or an upgrade thing. It's much more likely, I mean, not more often than not. Yeah, that's uh, nothing. Now, I wonder what happens when I uh, try to do a circle on this thing. Nothing. Alright. Interesting, it didn't do the animation that time. A little strange. Hey gang, what's up? Alright, well, I wasn't able to get any out of that, so let's just go ahead and... I 
I think that's the annoying thing I couldn't beat. Alright, I guess I'll do this then. You know, honestly, it's probably best to deal with these annoying things as quickly as you can because um, they'll just slow you down. Hopefully that thing doesn't disappear. Ah, got a portal key. That, that should be helpful, because it means there'll be, uh... One less of those I have to get before I can get the last Chaos Emerald. Guys are also pretty annoying. Got another attack upgrade. Didn't I say I was going to cash in the stuff I had before I went out and, um, took on these guys? I guess it makes me a liar, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright, after I deal with this nonsense, I'll find the upgrade guy and, uh, hopefully take care of it then. Realistically, these upgrades probably don't make that much of a difference. I suspect you need a lot of them. Oh, I got all the cogs I need. I have one more than what I need. Hmm. Alright. Let's go find the upgrade guy. I also want to take care of these story missions if I can. understood those visions correctly, the ancients came from space, right? And they were wearing things that looked like the Coco, but they didn't seem, I don't know, alive. Do you know what the Coco really are? They originated as lucky charms for the ancients. They were never designed to contain their data, their wills. So they're yeah, the physical the manifestation of their memories? The memories of their creators. Maybe the ancients changed them, or... Maybe the Coco wanted to keep their memories alive after they were gone. Nope. Oh well. <clears throat> okay, so let's go and... Uh... Ah. This one seems to be closer, so I'll go there. Alright, so I guess the good news is I didn't have to fight one of those uh, big annoying guardians or only get the cogs I needed. That's not really any bad news to report on that. For some reason I chose to say it like that, though. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, get that and uh, get this upgrade. And we have one more portal to go through. I was able to find a key in uh, one of those smaller enemy encounters, so that's one less I have to get. Thought I got two of those. Guess I was mistaken. 
Ok. I wish those things would stay revealed. Because of my natural instinct is to just uncover them. Even if I know that it's just a spring or a bounce pad that I revealed earlier. It's like, oh, what if it what if it's something useful? Like that. I mean that's not quite useful anymore, but still. I don't hear any of the little guys here. I must have picked them up already. <laughs> All right. You know, I don't remember getting that achievement for unlocking all the portals on other islands. That doesn't mean I didn't get it. I just don't remember. All right, so I need 120 rings. There's nine portals on this island. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, yeah, all right. So 120 rings, that's a lot. Hopefully that means there's a lot to collect in a short amount of time, but we'll see. Ah. It is not allowing me to skate backwards. So, that red ring I missed, I'm going to have to do that on another playthrough. I'm still going to try to pick up all the others I see, but I'm going to try, more importantly, to get these um, 120 rings. I like the music in this level. These uh, platforms seem to be giving me an excessive amount of difficulty. There we go. Well, according to this, I actually missed two red star coins. Not only did I miss that last coin, I didn't get 120 rings. Okay. Minute 15. That's actually not... Might be achievable? Not sure. So the question is, where's the second coin then? The second red, not coin, I don't know why I call it that, it's a ring. Red star ring. Where is it? It's, I gotta figure out. Is 
that it right there? I don't think it is. It's one I've already collected. <sighs> I was trying to do the, um, click the left analog stick there, but the warp across these rings where it wouldn't let me. got the 120 rings I needed. I still need to go back through and find this last coin. This last red star ring. It doesn't seem like this um, has any like branching paths to it, so... Ah, that... Believe it or not, that was actually exactly the right thing to do, is to kill myself, because, hey, this means I don't have to, like, uh, sit there and complete the level. I just get the ring. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Okay, come on, game. Holding down right trigger when you're on skateboard does not make you go faster. <laughs> Alright. Hopefully, uh, this will give me enough uh, uh, keys to get that last emerald. Remember, I got one in the environment. Actually fighting like an enemy. So, I actually have four more than what I had before at the start of the stream. Awesome. Um, apparently I need to collect these memories. Sonic doesn't seem to like to plant himself on these small edges. And it probably means that that wasn't the way I was supposed to get that, but... Alright, let's see if I can destroy this thing and get some of these memories. I still feel like an idiot for drowning in the first one of these things I encountered. Nothing. Alright. Alright, so first of all, let's um, not waste time when we can just fast travel. Yeah, all right.
need 28 here. Uh, excuse me. I had a rather large sneeze there. So. Where are these, um, sage levels? i try to get all these things if I can. Yeah. It kind of would be nice if these um, boss enemies disappeared after you unlocked all the portals. They really are just there to get in your way at this point. Just saying. This is going to be a spring, isn't it? Yep. But I get it, because what if it's a cache of memories? Get like a dozen of those little heart things out of one of those. came to this world tens of thousands of years ago. The planet was still underdeveloped back then, and their technology was vastly superior to anything else You at mean the, time. the planet or the I people who lived on it? Time, but the fact that it was really alien was surprising. The floating building, giant structures, cyberspace. It didn't make sense that such advanced stuff was also super old. But it all came from space, so well, there you go, I guess. What would this world look like if the ancients had survived, I wonder? Under different circumstances, I would enjoy running the simulations. So, can we assume that this is not Earth? Or is this, um... Earth? Or is it like Mobius? Was Mobius ever featured in any of the, um, games or just the cartoon? These guys also drop hearts. But that wasn't one of them. Hmm. I wonder how I get up there. To be with this loot thing. Oh, okay. Nope, I just need to hit that box. So. There's actually not a lot of these sage things left. Besides some of the main last one, there's only two others, including this one. Nah. Sonic can't run forever. Cyberspace actually interact with my brain? It was designed to catalog neural networks, among other things. So, yes. Alright, hear me out. Catalog? You, think all those locations you mean I visited map? Were pulled from my memories? That is plausible. It imported the data of your memories and applied it to your surroundings so you could comprehend them. 
Maybe that gave me the edge I needed to escape each time. I was covering familiar ground. Well, I guess that explains why Go these me. alien cyberspace levels are based on old Sonic games, wouldn't it? <laughs> I remember them uh, being um, critical, somewhat critical, of that design implementation in the um, Digital Foundry video on this game. That they just look like old Sonic games. Well, that one little throwaway line really just sort of explains it. Honestly, I feel like that should be in, like, a one of the main required Sage interactions, not these side ones. But, I guess I digress. Alright, and then we have just one more somewhere around here. Yep. Created by Eggman, right? Correct. My base code was compiled by him. The scope of my capabilities was vastly modified once I integrated with cyberspace, but he is my creator. <laughs> oh man, I bet he never expected his genius AI would advise him to work with me. I put forward this scenario with the highest likelihood for survival. That is all. All right, so I think that's all the optional sage stuff, I th think. There's no way, there's no good way of seeing the whole map at once. Actually, this one over here. Eh. You can only fast travel to the portals, I guess. Ooh, yoink. It's not what I'm looking for, but I'll take it. Ooh. Yeah, that's what I um, get for not being quick enough. Or for doing that backwards. Now, I don't think I actually uh, spent uh, much time, um... ...around this, uh, structure. That could be helpful because there's a good chance that there's, like, uh, some of those, um... Some buried caches around here. That clearly wasn't one of them, but there could be one elsewhere around here. Oh, a bunch of these guys hanging out. Cool. I wonder how they got up here. Oh yeah, now I remember. And there is one all the way up here. Just like that, two more up attack upgrades.
I need seven to interact with this one. Wow. All right. Hmm. Yeah, well, at least I remembered where it was. So how messed up do you think the last boss of this game is going to be? Like, should I also put in some additional time to, um, finding these little cocos to get more ring capacity? I mean, I know I set the difficulty level to easy, but still. This game has some rather bad difficulty spikes. And you have to imagine that the last boss of a game is going to be the hardest. So, I don't Should I approach this? I mean, I could take a look at the map here and see what marks these um, memories. I mean, it doesn't show like um, caches of them. It just sort of like... Yeah, spots where they are. Kind of a lot of a work to go through just to get one of those, especially when you need like 30 of them. <laughs> All right, um, I assume that just means it's buried and I need to do this, right. Apparently not. Hey. Hmm. Maybe it's pointing at these guys.
Nah, it wasn't it. Oh, I see it. It's up in the air. Got it. I know. I'm not the sharpest tool in the box. see it floating up there. I see it. I think. Could be a different one, but... Counts, it counts, kind of doesn't matter. Keep going then. Okay, good. Now these some these guys often drop these things, so I should probably take them out. This game gives you no iframes at all. Okay, you gave me one. I see one up there. Yeah, the pacing of this game is slowed way down when you have to, like, actually stop and look for these memories. See another one over, over there. Now the game will actually tell me when I have enough of these to do the next uh, main uh, sage interaction sequence, but it won't tell me when I have enough to do the um, that other that optional one. I think I only needed what seven. Hmm. <clears throat> 
Finally got the parry attack thing. That's nah, less than useful. <laughs> Even if there were like more levels after this, and those things don't carry from level to level. Hey, someone in the chat. How's it going? How are you doing? I should mention that uh, I do have a, uh, I should have a poll running somewhere on my channel. Um, asking what the next, my next game should be. Yeah, it is in fact running. Uh, I'm thinking of either uh, doing Forza Horizon 5 Hot Wheels expansion, or um, the Hot Wheels expansion for Forza Horizon 5 on the Series X, or um, playing through The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap for the Game Boy Advance with the help of my new analog pocket. So if you're interested in giving your opinion on that, see if you can find my poll on my channel. It should be under, like, community, I guess. And vote you care enough ooh I can uh, cash in these cocoa here oh that's them all of them being deposited okay cool I also need to cash in the other things I got I wish I could just do all this at once here. Hey. If there was one there, I guess I already got it. <laughs> okay. Come on, give me a cache of hearts here. Nope. Here's one. Attack upgrade, I'll take one. Oops.
Yeah, this is a pretty good looking game. And again, I'm easily impressed by big vistas and just looking over a big, pretty landscape. Alright, let's... Guess I can make my way back to that pyramid thing and um, see if I got at least enough uh, these memories to do the optional side sage conversation thingy. I think I have enough of that. Ooh, wow, that's... I wonder how you get to that thing. I don't know. Might have something to do with this. Not fighting you. Remember, I have all these portals unlocked, and I have a uh, several additional these cog pieces I don't need. <laughs> yeah, I saw that one up there. Can't just brute force my way through it. Okay. Explore. Harvest all you need from the island to succeed. Okay, why is the um Seek the one you call Elder Coco? Why is the uh, locust queen vitality. from Gears of War interrupting me? Seek the me? one you call Hermit Coco to exchange one for the other. Or make him offerings to raise your strength and resilience. Use your companions oh, to you better cannot be serious. The Enter the purple portals to find the keys and resources. The game must think need. I'm lost. All will aid you in your journey. What is this? late to be doing that kind of tutorial, don't you think? I wonder if I can... Nope. Hmm. 
Nah, I missed that thing, didn't I? If I climb up this wall, I can get it. Nope, it wasn't close enough. Remember, I need these things in order to continue the game. Now, how in the world did these two get up here? So I need to find the um the ramp that I used before. Is this it? I hope this is it. I don't think that's it. I think this is it, right here. No, it's not. Okay, game. You can stop this, please. There we go. Game wasn't letting me leave the ch 2D camera perspective. I mean, I could move the camera on, but it wasn't letting me leave that plane. I think this will get me there. So if all goes well, I should be able to finish this game either tomorrow or Saturday. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it today. And I'm not just saying that because it's taking me forever to get this, uh, get up this pyramid either. Ooh, yoink.
You can't just take control of that last Titan, can you? I have made multiple attempts, but all failed. And this is okay, the so there are four Titans. One, right? I don't want any more surprises. I can confirm only four were constructed. Well, then let's do it to it. We're out of time. We've got to save everyone, everywhere. Yeah. Alright, so I still need five of these memories. You know what, I don't know how I would even get that. Alright, so let's set this something a little more manageable. Uh, yeah, let's go this way. Not fighting you. I almost went right off the cliff there. Good job, me. All right, um. I should be able to get them in this area. Okay. Come on, game. There we go. Just in case it wasn't obvious, even though the camera was locked in a 2D perspective, my movement was not. Okay, that's a spring. Um... I think that's one I tried to get earlier. Hoping it'd be here. Oh, look at that. Cool. I 
I only need one more left. This game will likely do everything in its power to prevent me from getting it, too. <laughs> Think go away. You are not invited to this. Thankfully, I don't need to actually climb up to the top of Pyramid this time. I just need to get to right here next to this computer terminal. And after this, I don't think I have to worry about these memories anymore. There is a Chaos Emerald inside. Your power is required to access it. First, we gotta open that door. Are you good with hanging around? I thought you were supposed to be looking after Eggman while he helps hunt down the emeralds. I will be at his side when he needs me. Uh, I've, now, I've been the one hunting down the emeralds, the not him. Hand. Use your power to start the system. Hurry, our time is limited. Of course it is. What do you think it's going to be? This is an ancient pinball machine. You must get a hundred million points in less than a minute. If you do not, your save file will be corrupted. <laughs> I'm going to give this a quick save simply because I, I don't know, I feel paranoid. All right, let's see what this thing has to offer. Oh, one of these things. All right. The uh, Ikaruga type deal. I feel like this should be more of a spread shot. So as long as I'm in this mode, it won't these bolts won't actually damage me even if I don't hit them with mine. Okay. So I wasn't exactly clear that that was the case. And again, I do admit to being an idiot. I should probably um, do that at some point.
wow, this thing has a lot of health. There we go. I did okay, I guess. Wait, didn't it say time was limited? I assume she meant that literally, like you will have a time limit. Apparently not. Emerald number six, here we come. So, earlier you said I had zero chances of winning. You change your mind yet? No, but I have not run a simulation on our present circumstances either. Ah, well, don't do that. I, I don't want to spoil the ending. <laughs> I am saying we are in a desperate situation. The threat we face is beyond imagination. Hey, if there's even a 1% chance I can turn that despair of yours into hope, I won't disappoint. You know, the fact that there's a floating memory in this area in which you should not be able to access unless you completed all of the sage quest, that's a little disturbing because it means that means I have to collect um, more of them. Right? Yeah, I saw that little guy there. I'll see if I can pick him up on the way out. Actually, what's kind of confusing is that they had me collect the vault keys before unlocking the door. You'd think they'd be the other way around, like collect the memories to unlock this door, and you find the Chaos Emerald vault, and then you need to collect One more. the vault keys to hurry up. Access it. I don't know. Sonic. What? Hey, you. Where have you been? Other than not finding the Chaos Emeralds. I know. You're not fast enough, so I found it for you. Go ahead and beat that giant. Oh. You dare lose it. So I now thought why, I that it would be on you. top of the Titan, whatever. You know, I wasn't actually ready to fight this boss yet. There's some upgrade seeds I could have used. Oh well. Either I'll beat it the first time and I won't have needed them, or... I won't, and I'll get an opportunity to get them. I did do a hard save before that one thing. Uh, but not... I wish I'd done one afterwards. Whoa, what is that thing? Titan Supreme. That means it comes with sour cream on it, right? Should have uh, tried to parry that. I don't think it like that. <laughs> Looks vaguely like something from Bayonetta there.
I mean, it's not that crazy, unless I'm mistaken, Bayonet is a Sega character, right? It's not giving me any prompt to do anything with that. Okay, it sounds like this music music should be playing over the um, intro of the um, GSL finals. It does not sound like Sonic music, but whatever. I don't think that was the last boss. Is that it? No. All we did was chase it out of its shell. It's retreating into space to regain its true form. Even Supersonic won't be able to stop it. I know what I must do. I must leave you. I understand. Go. Fulfill your function. And what function is that? And while you're doing that, can I take a moment to cash in my upgrade seed? No? <laughs> Hurry, before it regains its full strength. Ladies first! going on here. That's what we're fighting.
Well, at least it didn't drop me off the last save point. So, what did I do wrong there? I was tapping X. Should I have just held it? like golf or something. Like a golf gamer. Ooh, pretty. Especially on my nice OLED here. What? So is the uh, last boss fight just a QTE sequence? Anyway. Well, that would make you Suzuki happy. Please look after father. I don't think Sonic's gonna do that, little girl. So what was it I just destroyed? Was that like a evil yes. moon? All right. Was that the villain from the fifth element that I just destroyed? Am I crazy for drawing that comparison? Sad Robotnik. Yeah. Oh, remember when I said I wasn't expecting to beat the game today? I was being honest, but I was wrong. Oh dear. Um, crap. So yeah, that was an unexpected way for the game to end. I uh, destroyed moon of some kind, and yeah. Probably there's going to be a post credit scene, possibly setting up a sequel. I don't know.
on how long these credits are going to last. Crap. You think this is some sort of copyrighted song here? Am I gonna get a copyright strike for this? I doubt it. All right, post credit scene. So, that was fun. I don't think we can fit everyone on that plane. But I guess it's time we got moving. I know you all have big plans. You're gonna hardly recognize me when we see each other again. I wonder if Cream and Sticks are free. <laughs> Make a road trip out of it. It'll be good to get back to my island. At least, for a while. We're wasting daylight! Let's go! You know, mid credit scene, I guess. It looks like I'm probably going to be taking less rest of the stream week off and then starting up my next game on Wednesday? I'm not sure. Like I said, I wasn't expecting to finish this game today. Um, crap. I'm not sure when I'm going to start up. I might start up sooner than that, but yeah. Like I said, I have a poll on my 
YouTube channel. Um, under, yeah, under the, under the community section. Basically, a uh, choice between either Forza Horizon 5 Hot Wheels and the Series X or The Legend of Zelda The Minish Cap, the Game Boy Advance on the analog pocket as my next game. Doesn't necessarily mean that the other will be the game after that. Uh, I do have some games coming out soon that I'm interested in. Uh, there's uh, that uh, Dead Space remake I wouldn't mind playing. Also on the 19th, uh, both Persona 4 The Golden, as I like to call it, and Persona 3 Portable are coming to Game Pass. And, um... Oops. I haven't played um, Persona 4 since... I played about halfway through the Vita version of that game. And I played the PS2 version, uh, actually on an emulator. I'm not entirely sure if I actually want to play that game again. I've seen the Giant Bomb Endurance run so many times. I don't know. And unfortunately, the PS3, ver uh, the Persona 3 game, is based on the portable one. I wish they just did an update of the... Uh, Persona 3 FES. Robotnik at a computer. Guess he would be old school to want a mechanical keyboard there. What are you doing? He's trying to find his daughter, I bet. Yeah. What? Um. So yeah. You want to help me figure out my next game? Go ahead and vote in that poll. Um. I had started playing through the Minish Cap. Uh. Separately on my DS Lite. But this would be an opportunity for me to stream the game. Because I don't have the ability to connect a DS to my capture card. But this analog pocket, I do have the dock. And yeah. What's this arcade mode here? Oh, you just play through all the individual levels. All right, it's kind of neat, I guess. All right, that's nothing interesting. So yeah, I guess that's going to do it for me today, folks. Um, like I said, vote in that poll if you want to help me figure out which one of those games I'm going to play next. Um, not sure when I'm going to stream next, as I was expecting not to finish this game today, but yeah. But uh, before I go, I'm going to take a moment uh, to thank you for watching. I appreciate when people take time out of their day to watch my streams, rather than being live or even in archive form. Uh, just as a quick reminder, I do a stream like this almost every day, 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time from Wednesday through Sunday. And yeah, um, hopefully I'll be able to get my act together and figure out when I'm going to stream next. Uh, but yeah, either Wednesday or sooner. How about that? But uh, regardless of what, when I, what I ever, what I ever I end up playing or whenever I end up start playing it, uh, thank you for watching, and until next time, take it easy.